Hey Taurus, welcome back to Star of the Universe Tarot. This is your mid-month check-in for May. If you do not follow me on Instagram, feel free to. I go live every Sunday for week ahead readings. I also go live for the full moon readings. Those are always by element. If you're looking for Zodiac specific messages, that will always be here on YouTube. So make sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Especially if the content is relatable. I um, just started this month love messages. If not, that's totally cool. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If you have to leave the whole thing behind, then I have a playlist of countless content. Um, I was saying also that I did just start love readings this month. Um, I'm going to be doing love readings, so what you need to know in the next 72 hours and the, um, the mid-month check-ins. Okay, so those are going to be the three that I'm going to be posting monthly for all 12 zodiac signs okay i'm also on tiktok stars universe 777 if you want to see short collective messages all right <clears throat> let's see taurus what do we have going on for you okay you have blossoming abundance the sacral chakra archangel ariel Killer of the ages, you have the man holding the heart under the deck. Okay, so you're going through a lot of changes in your life currently, Taurus, and a lot of it has to do with uh, your creative energy. Um, a lot of you guys may have gotten some type of job. Some of you guys may be dealing with a Pisces. Some of you guys could be dealing with, um, with, um, I'm feeling Aries energy as well. Some of you guys could be dealing with a water sign, but basically what I'm seeing here is that you have created your own luck Taurus um you've found out everything that you needed to know about a certain situation of maybe about a certain somebody here um and it's like now that you have everything all figured out you've noticed how somebody was suppressing you of some type of maybe a, a talent or some kind of power or some kind of uh, relationship here with the man holding the heart um but now that you've analyzed it down to a t you understand why you had to go through certain situations because i feel like you may have uh, been in a bit of a funk here torres where you're kind of like why do these things always happen to me or um why am i always um getting the the short end of the stick or like there is just something that just wasn't going your way for a long time. And now that you're finally in a place, probably with the 5-1 here starting off in your um, in your solar year, Taurus, as we came into um, Taurus energy, maybe you started feeling it at the end of at the end of every season. But you definitely understood that there was something bigger than you guiding you towards your next steps. And some of you guys may be dealing with um, with the Christian Pantheon, um, or, or, or come from a Catholic background, or a Jewish background of some sort. But there's definitely a lot of um, archangels that are surrounding this quest or this spiritual journey that you are um, enduring at this moment, Taurus. And you know it because you you see the fruits of your labor here. You're like in this nine of pentacles energy um, with the blossoming abundance here. It's like there could be a reconciliation that you're trying that you're praying for here with the um, with the three and then the thirty six here. It's like a reconciliation and love. Yeah, because somebody wants to change something. They want to start back at the beginning with five and one. It's like there's stability in this relationship, but there, something had to change. So either you um, or this person went through a very serious tower moment. Maybe the relationship in general went through a tower moment. Um, there could have been a breakup. Um, so you're really, really um, hoping that this time apart really brought this person some kind of growth or that this person could recognize the growth in you because it's been such a long time since, since um, you guys have been able to see eye to eye even though there's still a lot of love here and even though there's I, I feel like even 
offers and gestures of love um, in this re in this situation, there is no relationship. Maybe no, possibly even no contact. Cla uh, clarify is also in abundance. Yeah, dance. Move your body to the music. Dance with the rhythm of life. Manifest your dreams through dance. Yeah, so you decided to change your energy here. And that's how you um, called in this blossoming abundance. Clarify the second, cha um, second chakra here. Yeah, you have possibilities. Yeah, as you moved away from this relationship, you saw that there was growth coming here. It's not that you wanted to say goodbye to this person forever, Taurus. No, it's just you knew that this person was going through some kind of growing pains or this person was going through some some kind of transformation. Or maybe even this person had to come to the realization that they also were a healer or they too, because I feel like you have a lot of... Um, like esoteric energy around you Taurus um so this person or like I said you could be very talented and this person could have felt less than because you hold something of value to them but they don't what they're what they're coming now to realize is that they never needed to feel inadequate because both of you guys bring different things to the table and because both of you guys bring different um, things to the table there's a lot of growth in the energy there's a lot of um, a fresh start is like approaching um, full card energy yeah but this person was very much obsessed with you in the past and they couldn't let you go I even now I think that you started to see the reflections of your obsession and what you went through um, over giving in this relationship clarify dance and blossoming abundance we have four and five again this person's holding on to you and they realize that they self-sabotaged many times in the past i think that this person realized that when you walked away the last time that they sabotaged this relationship this person thought that they were gonna bring back like some type of gift here with the man holding the heart and um, and the moon card here under the deck they thought that they were going to come back rather quickly but something delayed them here with the two of swords like something kept them from you and there's a truth here that's about to be revealed with the five of swords that's actually going to bring a lot of healing to this situation because there's illumination now with this with the um, moon card there is a lot of secrets yes but this person I feel like is finally um willing to talk about what exactly went wrong or why exactly did they run away or why exactly you know they're really they're ready to give you details they're ready to give you details because they see that that the possibilities are endless with you with the moon card here and they see your creativity and they admire it they admire your intuition with the moon card and the second chakra here they know that um with the um, with the healer of the ages here that what you're doing is 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 beyond anything that they could imagine clarify um possibility well you have the king of cups in the reverse yeah they know that they fucked up they knew that they weren't giving to this relationship they knew that they were emotionally unavailable and it wasn't fair for them to hold back secretly all of these hidden emotions and expect growth in this situation so they decided to 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 kill it all together because i feel like Taurus, they understood that you deserved something better than what they were giving to you here with the world card here and a part of it is i i believe that they are not um in a stable position financially to give you what you want at the moment um they were strategizing it because they really did see a caring connection with you but i feel like there is somebody who's financially stable that's also looking at you from afar and i feel like this person is willing to call on you like if this is a person long distance like they're willing to um fly you out with the journey here or they're willing to um spend that extra money you know and that time and that energy to really get to know you and really grow this connection because they see the long term with you and this person that that's dealing with these financial constraints like they're they're going through their own cycle that they have to that they have to close out in
in order for there to be a transformation within them it could be this water sign character that's that came out in the reverse but there's a there is an earth sign here with the king of pentacles that is actually already vibrating at the same vibration here look with the sim card and the king of pentacles under the deck this person sees you and they see happiness with you and this person is not hiding any secrets because look you have the moon card next to the king of cups in the reverse and you have the sun card with the king of pentacles in the in the upright like this person's enlightened this person understands that there were people in the past they're gonna you could have communicated with this person already you could be a gemini here with the knight of swords but i feel like this person understands that you have a lot of people really obsessed with you and there's a lot of people around you that are going through judgment and meanwhile you're trying to make this reconciliation happen because the judgment card is also a reconciliation card which was what i felt in the very beginning with this three and the blossoming abundance you have to let go of this person in the past that was full of secrets in order to to um call in this this soulmate here that is at your vibration it could be a fellow earth sign a taurus virgo or capricorn but um it could be a leo as well with the sun card but their happiness is you and they know that they have everything in their hand to make you happy too you just got to be open to um to making this relationship work and letting go of this person in the past that once again that had nothing but secrets all right that's what i have for you Taurus, and i hope this helps bye